pull the hammer back, squeeze it, gives you a lot amount, a great amount of firepower in a very short amount of time. And this is a 44 caliber round pistol ball. Not, doesn't seem like it'd be very much, but at a low muzzle velocity at 50 yards, it can do some serious damage. Um, there was, uh, we're talking about earlier, all right, you're, you, you know, yeah, you, you know it's coming, so you're, you know, trying to shoot, pistol ball hits you in the hand, okay? Someone, soldier, officer presents himself to you, shot through, with a pistol ball in the hand. What, what is the, what is the treatment? Uh, uh, first Bull Run, Manassas, General Jackson, where he worked with General Retirement. He was shot in the hand, and he stayed in the saddle. If he went through the palm of the hand and it missed the uh, ligaments, it, it's gonna be really, really sore. You're gonna have a hole in your hand. <laughs> but there again, the grip, drain it, you know, have something for drainage. But um, if it had spent, hit something, flattened out, and then hit, more than likely, you would lose the leaders and get a big hole. Infection sets in, you have to amputate it. It depended on, you ever heard that was saying, I've known him, he ain't been sick a day in his life. And then you hear someone, he's always been sick. A lot of it dealt with the the body itself, because if you were a healthy person all your life, you get cut, you heal up, you have pretty good chance to make it. But with a bullet in and out, like Jackson's hand, notice he didn't have his hand amputated. It just went in, went out. It didn't hit anything vital. Of course, he probably, probably grew back over time. A lot of times when you were shot, even today, they'll leave the bullet in. Of eventually that bullet's gonna work its way back out. But if you've got a bullet lodged in the spinal cord, and I'm speaking today as well as back then, if it was lodged in here and you were living when they got finished with everybody else because you were shot in the chest, then they would try to help you because you were still alive. A lot of times they would leave that bullet in and they were always plagued with chronic pain. Triage system. Triage system. Help who you can help, and yeah. those who you don't think you can help, but they're still alive when you're done, then we'll get to you. I know a gentleman whose ancestor, he was going up the hill. He was shot through his canteen and it went into his bladder. The bullet eventually worked its way out, but he had a hole in the side, and he always had to go to the bathroom frequently because if he didn't, he would be urinating out of the hole in the side. <laughs> And now we move on to